Hello guys, my name is Eric Van Wilderman. My name is Benson, and welcome back to Meow. Sorry, I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. Okay, forgive me. Anyways, where we last left off, we were in the library with this girl named Novella, who oddly looks like Aya. Take a look at her face. She looks like Aya with glasses, but I'm not really sure. Could be, it couldn't be. And we are covered in blood because we hid inside a corpse while Yoshino got killed. It was just sick. And we're gonna go explore some more. Wow, okay, so there's a switch here I missed last time we were in the lab, so I'm just gonna push it. <gasps> okay, the Mandragor is here. I think we gotta lead it somewhere, I guess, if it's following us. But where in the hell will we lead it? There's something in there. Maybe it'll scream and we'll break the glass or something. Activate it. Sure, let's activate the capsule. It requires a boot disc. Oh, I shit! Maybe I needed the boot disc before I even came in here. That's crazy shit, huh? Madness, I tell you! What just happened? Oh! Oh my god! Are you Why, Mr. Silhouette Man? God damn it, he has anger issues and he killed little poor us. Okay, whatever, the first floor hates me. We're not going back there. Oh no, 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 I- No, no way. Maybe it's someone. There's someone in the locker looking inside. Sure, this is a different classroom. This isn't the same one. Let's open it. Maybe it's one of our friends. Oh, it's the teacher! Oh, hey, teacher! Monster. What? No, oh, I'm not. Oh, no, teacher, it's me. I'm covered in blood, but it's- <gasps> What? What? She is the, the worst teacher ever. I'm a teacher and I've never killed one of my students. Horrible. Okay, fuck you, teach. I just want to read this book. I can I read the book? I want to read the book. You know what I'm going to do? I just want to say no. I don't want to look inside. I'm just going to leave you in there. That's right, I looked in there and I just left you, you son of a bitch. You son of a bee. Oh! Did you see that? There was a ghost there. What? It's like a never-ending hallway. The ghost appears there. And then we just keep on going. And the ghost keeps on appearing there. Maybe I got a step here. <gasps> no, it doesn't work like that. Well, <laughs> this school's tripping me out, guys. It's tripping me out. I don't know where to go. Okay, seriously, fuck the second floor. We're going up here. Fuck the popo. Fuck everybody. What? Holy shit! Can I say hello to him? <laughs> he's just a troll. He's not really a dangerous monster. He's like, I'm just gonna troll you and stand in your way. Even if there's something really important back here. Okay, is there- Finally, there's nothing in the locker that can kill me. Finally, but is there anything else in there? No. There's nothing that can kill me. <gasps> oh, it's you! You- Oh, Toma! It's your fault that Sao Tome's dead. Toma! Ah! <laughs> ah, there it is! What? Please, calm down. It's just me, Bencina. Bencina, d don't startle me. Why are you a bloody? You always struck me as tough, but I guess you're really a coward. Man, Bencina just says it how it is. Yeah, it's right, slap in the face to you. Well, what's that? Still, I can't believe Sao Tome is dead. Oh, Tome. Oh, he didn't really care for her anyways. That's, he, all he cares about is himself. It ain't my fault. I didn't do nothing wrong. It's all me Sao. Damn it, me Sao's gonna kill me. Help me, Bencina. I don't care, maybe you should die, Toma. You help me then. We'll save Misao together. Huh? Don't be fooling. It's Misao's fault all this happened. Why the hell you want to save her? Get some grammar, motherfucker. Would you rather stay here forever? Because I don't care what happens to you. Later. <laughs> Bensina is such like an uncaring bitch. Holy shit, Benson. She's just like you. You guys are like a perfect match. Fuck yeah, I want a boner. Oh yeah. Wait, wait up. Okay, I'll do whatever. Just don't leave me alone. Okay. Toma, lick my shoe. Lick my fucking shoe. Oh, alright, don't fall behind. Y yeah, okay, let's go. Oh, really? He's gonna come with us? I don't. I <gasps> oh my god, there's a shadow there. Oh, his shadow's gonna kill him. Oof. <laughs> yes. Toma. Well, she doesn't care, she's still smiling. Look at her, she's just like. <laughs> Toma, stay with me. Oh, never mind. She she's, feels pretty awful about it, the way she's talking. Ah! Oh! Guff! Good, he's still breathing. I have to get him treated. Really? Oh, Jesus, me sa- oh, not, Sorry, not me, Sal. <laughs> Bencina, you are tough. She just picks him up and don't worry, I'll carry you. Carry over here. Holy shit, Bencina laughs at other people's deaths and she just carries 
people around that are obviously heavier than him. Help Toma, please! He's my classmate! Yeah, sure, why- Oh, there's a bed here, okay. Whew, this should be good. Good. He's just lying on the bed now. Because lying on the bed cures you, you know that. Seriously. Whenever you're split open and bleeding everywhere, just lie down on a bed. Seriously, it'll work. Novella, Toma, stay here for a while. The spirits don't seem to come here. What? Well, well, I can't do that! Not with this mysterious man! He's just my classmate. Toma's not that scary as- What do you mean? He ran away from Saotome. Then again, he was just being a coward. He wasn't actually trying to cause shit. But he seems like he would cause shit to save his own ass. Oh, well, if you say so, Ben Cena. Well, you are my friend after all, so you better listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> Is this gonna be okay? No, it's not gonna be okay. You should just kill Toma. Okay, let's go back upstairs. That was an interesting turn of events. Okay, this is the classroom I went into with that evil spirit. I wonder, I'm gonna save my game. There's an autosave feature that I wasn't using before and you just save it. So if you die, you go back to that autosave. It's kind of different than normal autosaves in games. Normal autosaves are if you die, you gotta go back to your main save, but autosaves are there for if you quit the game. Oh. What? <gasps> I just wanted to check if she was all right. I caught you. Oh my God. I didn't know it was an evil spirit. I thought I was a student. Oh, I am so happy I autosaved there. So friggin' happy. Okay. Yeah, screw you, biatch. Yeah, you wanna crawl to me? You're so slow. You're so slow. You can't get me. Can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. Yeah, try it. That's right. Reach for my bum. She's reaching for my bum, but she can't get Ben Cena's bum. That's right. Can't touch this. <laughs> where the hell am I? Oh, I'm on the roof. That's where I am. I was like, why is this? <gasps> no! Suicide! Suicidal, but she looked like just a spirit. She didn't look like a student. Okay, like, whatevs. I'm sorry I didn't make it to save your life. <laughs> Better luck next time at life, evil spirit. <laughs> I love it how she falls every time. Does that make me sick? Okay, we were just in there. Let's go this way. Yes, yeah, screw you. I know you're a troll. What is this? An emergency bell. Fuck yeah, let's touch it. Nothing happens. Oh, sh no, stop pushing buttons. Push it then. Benzina pushed the emergency bell. Oh, yeah, baby. The emergency bell in my school does that too. Secret passages and shit. It's pretty fun cool. Okay, where? Oh, this is like some secret room. Let's learn a bunch of information. The principal's diary. Shower shish. I'm sorry, that's how I picture that sounding. <laughs> Even though I know what it means. It means we don't know the date, okay? Cloudy, the emergency exit key fell out of the vase. Somebody pick it up. The emergency exit key, okay, so it fell out of the vase. I know where that is, but I need to find something to break it. The emergency exit key fell out of the vase, somebody. Wait, wait, wait. The emergency exit key fell out of the vase. Here, a vase, it's fixed to the table. Inspect it. Ah, Jesus, I'm saving my game. Totally saving my game. You know what happened last time. Let's inspect. Oh, this is the same room. This is a secret passage to that same room. I'm so dumb. <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> I was like, this looks familiar. <laughs> oh, fucking Eric. Holy shit, I got a bat in this locker. That's pretty cool. I, I should be checking stuff, shouldn't I? So, oh, I, I got a bat. I can break it, the vase, because I got a bat. That's awesome. Let's go break that shit. Okay, here we go, baby. Got this baseball bat. That's right, finally I can break you. Been wanting to break you for the longest time. Yeah! Oh yeah, something came out of the vase. Emergency exit key. Fuck yeah! I gotta find this emergency exit now, though. Wait, wait, wait. Was this where the emergency exit was? Was it through here? It might have been through here, like at the end, because there was a locked room up here. It is the emergency exit. Yeah! You stupid- What? What? Oh, I'm in- I'm in the actual town. That's weird. <gasps> oh no, it's the stoner! Kudo! Stoner! <laughs> Benzina. Fucking high over here. You're hurt, oh, you're right. It looks like he's- half his body's like cut, but no, that's his foot. Okay, I can see it. A monster got me. I tried to run, but I sprained my leg. <laughs> it hurts. Oh, that's me, Sal. It hurts. Help! That voice. Meet me, Sal. Kudo can hear her too. 
Alcudo's a good guy. Misao is in pain. Damn, if only I had been quicker to save Misao. Oh, Kudo wants to save her too. Kudo is a smart guy. Weed makes you smart, maybe. Kudo? Misao and I were together since kindergarten. We played together all the time. Oh, that's why they were good friends. Okay. In middle school, I was teased for playing with a girl, so I tried to avoid Misao. Oh, you fucking asshole. When I learned Misao was being bullied, I didn't help her. No. Yeah, you're too busy smoking pot. I'm sorry, Mzao. Sorry, I couldn't help you. I'll be there soon. Oh, he's just gonna accept his death? Come on, you should still try, okay? I'm always beside you. Where's the sad music? There should be sad music playing. So don't cause any more sadness, okay, Mzao? Ooh, cack. Kudo! Help her watch. <gasps> Fuck it, no way. He seems like a nice guy. You know, he wants to repent for his sins. We're gonna help him. Are we gonna die though? <laughs> Kuda, please! Huh? Oh shit! <gasps> no! Don't do drugs. What an asshole movie, God, dude. We just gotta watch him die. I mean, what kind of a decision is that? It's like, you know, Ben Cena's real thinking is just he's sitting here like, ah, I'm just gonna watch as he dies. Whatever, I don't give a fuck. Okay, let's choose option help or I don't give a fuck. And that's what it should be. So let's just wa We're gonna watch him die. We're just gonna watch. Oh, wait, what? It's totally different. Where's the car? Misao came to meet me. Now we'll always be together. Okay. I love you, Misao. Is Misao really doing this all, though? Whoa, she's actually here. Holy shit. You're mistaken. I never liked you at all. Oh, no, he's dying. And <gasps> now die. Holy shit, man. Oh, now the car's gonna come. Oh, Mizo! Look at that. His head's like flying through the air, like, meow. <laughs> Sorry, it should be worse slow motion. Mizo! That's how I imagine it just happened. Okay. This is awful. But she's still smiling. <laughs> she's still smiling. <laughs> this is awful. Holy shit, what just happened? Can I get over there? Nope. 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 Nope, nope, nope. Oh, stop following me, ghost. You're freaking me out. Seriously. If I just tap the up button or back towards it a little bit, I die, and that is horrible. Okay, what? Okay, let's check on Toma. Let's just see how he's doing. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Huh? I am soaked in blood, and this sucks. I wish I wasn't soaked in blood still. Okay, fuck yeah. Look at this. We're outside. We went outside the main entrance. <gasps> Oh, oh my god! These are the gravestones of all the students that have dry, uh, died. There's Kudo's grave, Yoshino's grave, Saotome's grave. Sacrifice the body or the curse will never end. So we have to... S <laughs> so in this building right here, it says, Sacrifice the body or the curse will never end. So what we have to do, it looks like right here, we have to sacrifice our four friends, and then the curse will end after our friends are all dead. Holy shit, what's down here? Boulders over there. A boulder is in the way and we can't destroy it barehanded. We're gonna need a lot of firepower to destroy a brother freaking freaking boulder. What's this? A grave. You don't know the name on it. Okay, so this is just random. What? Your grave. <gasps> what? What's going on? What? What? Oh! <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm gonna end the episode here. I have died a lot. This game has a vendetta against me. It's like, oh, you beat Mad Father pretty easily, huh? You didn't die that much? Well, I died against the Doctor a lot. But, uh, yeah, this game really wants to kill me in any and every kind of way possible. So, yeah, I gotta be more careful. But how can you be careful against some of these deaths, though? Well, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching. As always, peace.